Alrighty, guys, we're back with more World Cup coverage. I am joined by no other than Booty. Uh, What's Booty going is, on? Hi. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, we are here to watch Africa play. Let's see who is Africa playing today. Africa is playing Mexico, and we got um, Angel Tiopo versus Yev Stone. Um, YS is known for being a pretty good player. I do not know well uh, enough information about the opponent from Mexico. Uh, unfortunately, Booty, do you know? Do you know anything about either player? Uh, I don't know anything about the uh, the guy with the uh, valiant and the the moth. Uh, I played. I don't know how to pronounce that. Is it Yves? Your, I go, uh, I'm going Vest with Stone? I'm going with Yves Stone. Yeah. Yeah, I have played them like in Smog and Tour and stuff before. It's definitely pretty, pretty decent. Mhm. Mm um, leads off like, with COVID. Let's see. Um, spikes up. Don't love that trade, but you know. Yeah, I mean, the cloak is gonna do nothing this game. There's no garg. Yeah, exactly. Spikes are up. I mean, only one spike went up, so you definitely live with that because the spike was gonna go. There's like no way really for him to prevent the spike going up. Yeah, I think I think the Tiopo guy is probably gonna have some like booster type offense. That's what it looks like. Yeah, definitely Judging booster it. spam for sure. <laughs> And I think he's going to need that to win, to be honest. If they are, like, anything other than that, I think he's going to have a hard time. Sorry, I got a phone call just now. Um, okay, let's see. So he goes to Dragapult that's left over, so it's probably... Sub. That starts, yeah. I don't know what last sub. Way yeah, it could, but... it could, and all you know, I was thinking like it's gonna be straight up like sub, but it could be like double wisp anti wave, uh -huh. and you know, yeah, I've seen whatever that. benefits in the world. I literally, I'm putting my phone down just to be real. I don't understand what he said, don't go. It probably has D Gleam. I think you gotta stay, and or you go Pex. It's really the, the two options. Looks looks like it's probably AV Pex. Um, Most be likely. A fine swap here. Okay. Doubles to the tusk. Looks like it was predicting the Toxapex. Let's see what this is. Maybe it's choice band. No, I think it's a jetpack. Yeah, it's oh, a jetpack. Jet okay. All right, that was not a bit. That was a pretty good play, actually. I mean, it's like uh, so he burned. So he burned the booster because I guess that's his only way to force out Corv effectively, which is unfortunate. Yeah, uh, force out Draga. Yeah. Well, he has. Oh yeah, I'm too. sorry. I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah my no, bad. No, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, force out Draga. I guess he didn't want to burn the. I would say. Because my thing is, he could have went... It's, it's, he had different options against the first half, but he went with the safest one. Yeah, I don't know what the Valiant is. Like, it could be Specs. Uh, I don't know what Bax is. That Bax seems like it's probably DD or... SD. I think you were right about what you said at the the start about it being booster spam. I'm pretty sure that's 100% going to be like a Calmine booster or SD booster. Yeah. I'm tripping. I was, I was saying Corvus or Dragon. I wonder if he goes to it now. Now he goes to this. So that, maybe it's SD booster. Or he's... Just, like, it actually, Kalmar Booster has, like, a pretty good matchup. SD probably even better at this point. If he if he whittles everything down, that, that can win. Absolutely. Do you stay in and risk dropping the Psychic? Do you tear here? What do you think? Do you just... Mm, you, let, you, you let something... Was. You sack something? I think the guy with the Moth, if he had Psychic, he would have used it. It was pretty free there. Uh... I think you stay in. Um, yeah, okay. 
That that works too. He decides to just okay. Yeah, I mean, because yeah, there's no speed booster, it makes complete sense. But I will say the only thing is though, he has to think about the possibility of Terra Fairy here, and then Hex is definitely not going to drop it. No, yeah, absolutely. He has to. This guy has to darts here. Hex isn't going to kill right now. And so I wonder, like, is it worth? T I I don't think the Terra's worth it here personally. No, nah, me neither. Because I think, um, I think it's probably going to be the most valuable on like Valiant or uh, Gambit, like depending um, what it is. The Gambit probably is not going to do much. There's Tusk, Iron Hands is still like 100% full bulk. Yeah. Okay. The only Gambit set that could put in heavy work is Terra Fairy. Yeah. Every other. I think I think I would have went to Gambit there. I would understand. Yeah, I would understand going to Gambit there. And I'm a. Oh, he went to it now, huh? Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. I I hope it doesn't SD. There's no reason to do that. And if I'm e if I'm stoned, I'm not. I wouldn't have switched there, but okay. Uh, no. uh, I guess that's fine. Yeah, yeah, it works. It works. I don't know. Cause he's not like he doesn't really need this for anything else besides besides Gambit, and uh, he still has Iron Hands as backup. Like I just felt like pretty... Dragapult, like it's it's not really going to accomplish much for the rest of the game. It's already low. Yeah, and, that's um, true. I think but... it just it'll prevent like spin. That's about it. Like. Uh, you could just keep it to like, I don't know, wisp or like prevent back setup maybe. Uh, those are the only things I could think of. Uh, that works too. Now you get the spin off. Yeah, get the spin off. You're looking pretty clean. I mean, you know, yeah. Stone is in a much more command commanding position. I mean, I don't know. This game oh, is. Oh, that absolutely. Was, that was interesting. Although I, won't, I don't think I would have done that. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. That was. I get what he was cooking. But, yeah. nah, I, I, the opponent really didn't have to spin there. It, it didn't have to become a, a, a war, like a trade thing, like, so. Okay, go straight yeah. for flame. Wow, that flamethrower did, why did that flamethrower do so much? 53, that must be, like, max special yeah. attacks. So, all right, this thing's going to win, then. This yeah, is, that, this is a this wrap. This is pretty much over. Um, let's see, wait, what is the tusk at? I guess... I guess maybe if he sacks everything, Gambit with Terra Fire could hack its way to victory, but... Yeah. It would need to be kind of like... You stay here with Volk? I feel like you kind of have to. Oh, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. And, and, like, you just, you just spam um, Flamethrower. Yeah. Have either of them Terra yet? No. Oh, my oh. God. The Terra Dragon? Yeah. Oh, I would have been cooked. I ain't gonna lie. Well, I mean, I, mm, I would have clicked Bug Buzz in that situation, but, like, you know, normal. Funny, just, just yeah, yeah, normal. oh, yeah. But, like, that would have... Oh, like, wow, that would have been crazy. Yeah. Okay, all right. If he mine. steal... No, he, already, he just burned uh, his Terry, remember? He just burned his Terry. Oh, yeah, the... that's right, that's right. Oh, so, that's that. Oh, AV Peck, so good. Look at that live. Yeah, it's a shame, like, taunt, the Combine set, like, I usually like it with Steel, yeah. For that, like, this Pex thing, like, he could have kept that. He probably would have won. This is the... Wait, what? That did so much. <laughs> that actually was scary for a second. That did too much. I was about to say... I was literally about to say, like, oh, look at hands actually, like, doing something for once. And then... Yeah. That was actually looking pretty scary where hands was going to get sent back. With a, with a eight yeah. Eight, oh, my God. It. Luckily, hands... Did not get flinched, and this game's pretty much over. I mean, this, yeah. what's done is done. Yeah, no, it's it's gone. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I, I, Stone played pretty solid, I would say. So Stone played pretty yeah. solid. Did solid have, matchup. Did what has to be done. Up, played well. Yeah. And I mean, I don't know. Didn't, didn't click anything out of panic. So, yeah, that exactly. was good. Well played. You know, they, opponent. I don't know. That, this, is, this is why I'm not, like, high. You know how I feel, like, about HO right now. This is exactly why. Mm-hmm. It's, it's, yeah, like it. You need to have like the right specific sets on offense and like like hyper offense like that. Whereas like I don't 
don't know. You just you run into one thing that ruins your momentum. It kind of kind of sucks it for the whole team. Yeah, like you, the rest of the game. Exactly. You're too, and you're very terror dependent. Like you're yeah. very terror dependent, and then you end up in a position probably where you burn your terror first before your opponent has to burn their terror. And like how yeah. it used to be in the you know in the in the shed tail meta game, you were usually putting them in a position where they burn it first. But no, go on. No, no, that's that's pretty much it. You're right. Like you have to usually burn it first, and like you need um, like more immediate breakers on these kinds of teams so that like muscle through this fat stuff a little bit better. That's that's what I've noticed. Like, or you need like a couple setup win cons. Like that always kind of killed this shit. Like. Like Volcarona would be would have been really good this game, for example, depending on which set it was and like uh he probably I don't know what his his terror was on uh Valiant, but he probably should have saved that. Like I feel like it's the calm on Moonblast Sideshock, maybe he was ghost or steel. So like I think that was still a better better move than what he did. Probably. Yeah. That was that was like a, a panic terror like you were mentioning earlier. You were hoping yeah. Stone wouldn't make because I don't know. Yeah, it did. The guy's terror did nothing. He he, he terrored and then died. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like problem. you need to like especially on HR you need to uh, really pick the right time to do it. I feel though, I don't know, even if you save it for Valiant, I don't think he was going to switch out his Volcarona if, um, mm-hmm. I think if anything, he definitely would have stayed in. I'm not sure if he would have quivered. I think the best place is always straight up attacking because you never yeah. know it could be Encore, so your best place is to attack it. Um, yeah, it could also be like, even at... At that point, you don't know. It could be SD, like, liquid. Yeah. Liquid Zen close combat. You could legitimately lose. Yeah, and if it's that, if it's that, you just, you're just cooking. You just got to go for flame body burns at that point. Like, there really is, that's it. Yeah. There's nothing. Yeah, exactly. So staying in and attacking, like you said, is probably the best move. But since he blew the Terra, he was like, okay, I'm good. Like, I don't, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Alrighty, guys. I mean, that's the game. That's the result. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you, Booty, for joining with the commentary. Not a problem. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Peace.